Hi everybody, my name is Daniel Weir and I've been at the school ever since kindergarten and I'm going to tell you about one unique experience from each grade. Uh, so in kindergarten, my teacher was uh, my teacher was Jacqueline, and according to her, I was quite misbehaved. Uh, <laughs> because of this, she made a sheet that had four categories. One, I was respectful. To, was I respectful to the teacher? Two, was I respectful to my classmates? And uh, three, did I talk when it was my turn to do so? Uh, and the last one I forget. <laughs> okay. Every day, right after school, I would meet up with the teacher and she would check things off that I did correctly. If I had a perfect day, I would win a prize. I started up, this started from the beginning of kindergarten and ended at the end of grade one. I only ever received three prizes. <laughs> Okay, so, that was kindergarten. In grade one, we played a lot of games with my teacher, Susan. One of those games was who took the cookies from the cookie jar. And, uh, you know, how you play this, I'm, I'm sure a lot of you know how to play this. You go around in a circle and ask, who stole the cookies from the cookie jar? Was it you? And they, and they just deny it, and it goes on for a while. Okay, so when it was my turn to be questioned, I just screamed rampage and ran around in the classroom, <laughs> jumping on the uh, jumping on the tables and jump and uh, like sliding over the chairs. <laughs> okay, <laughs> still only in grade two. <laughs> so in grade two, I made four new friends, and I basically only hung out with them for the entire year. So, couple of my good friends. Their names were Andy, Jonathan, Kevin, and Dragon. <laughs> now, Dragon is not his real name. His real name is Julian, but he thought that name was lame, so we all supported him and called him Dragon. Okay. So, Andy decided to start a gang and gave it the original name, Andy's Gang. In, in Andy's Gang, we never really did anything other than just hang out. Uh, which is kind of weird for grade twos. <laughs> so, one funny thing about the gang is that there were ranks. Boss, second in command, third in command, and so on. But that's not the funny thing. The funny thing was that in order to gain rank, you had to say a hard tongue twister. Uh, well, the other kids could only say Fuzzy Wuzzy was a bear. And I could do the entire rhyme with Peter Piper. And I instantly took the prestigious rank of second in command. Another funny thing was that we had to walk behind Andy or we were kicked out of the gang. <laughs> I'm serious. Uh, so, the only interesting thing about grade three for me was that all those four friends just left you hill. All of them. And uh, I never saw any of them again, except for Jonathan, who I once spotted at Best Buy. Um, <laughs> So in grade four, for the first time, I was in the popular class. Every year in this school, there is a popular class that has kids like, uh, like, like Sean G, Mason, and Costa in them. That's, that's just a few, I'm sure there's much more. That was the first year that I was. Okay, in grade five, I was in Janet's class, and it probably would have been my favorite school year if it wasn't for potato. Okay. Those of you who were in my class will know exactly who I'm talking about. He got on everybody's nerves. Everybody's, except for the teachers, maybe. Uh, one of our favorite things to say was, potato is bad at frying. This meant blank was bad at teaching. Because potatoes fry and teachers teach. <laughs> In grade six, well, grade six just sort of went by too fast for me to say anything. I don't remember much about grade six. And <laughs> <laughs> sorry, Miss <Eve. laughs> All right, so finally, this brings us to grade seven. I assume that the other three people would be presenting speeches 
they, they would talk about camp a lot. Uh, so I'm, gonna, I'm just going to skip that. And a funny, not, not that funny, but it's funny thing about grade 7 was at the beginning of the year, the very got us to do 20 essays. <laughs> okay? We're only in grade 7. <laughs> so, we, we, but thankfully, we stopped writing so many essays after the winter break. Uh, but through the entire year, we probably did about 30 essays. Okay. The three people I would like to thank the most are John Beach, who was the principal before Kathy, uh, for, for being the best principal in the cosmos. Jen. <laughs> Uh, Janet Logie for being uh, the most funny or most fun of any of my teachers. <laughs> and of course, Bonnie the counselor for always giving Mr. Navita a better solution than a punishment. <laughs> Thank you. I'll see you at Best Buy. <laughs>